That's the dead man switch. That's so if you fall asleep, this damn thing will cut off. You're supposed to sit there and hold it till it gets hot enough to let it go. Who the hell does that? Well, to make the situation worse, I put a hairband <clears throat> on the uh, cord. And that will hold this down. And I can rest with it on without holding the damn button down. And you see it doesn't have a ground. I call this the heating pad from hell. Yes, it was made in China. Sold at Walgreens. I've had this heating pad since 2007-2006. Uh, actually, an uh, old friend of ours had it. There's a number, I don't know what the hell it's for. Uh, might be a POW camp torture thing, who knows. Uh, <clears throat> an old friend of ours got it from her mom. And uh, we've had it ever since. And let me just tell you, this joker gets hot. And I've used it on my wrist when I've had gout on my arm, in my uh, wrist. And it blistered my arm. And uh, I don't see any of those scars. Plenty of scars like that one right there. But it blistered the hell out of me. And when I say blistered, I mean blistered. <laughs> See? I had a toothache ever since Thursday and the day of Saturday. And I put this bad boy on my chin and rested my hand on the back of it up against my chin and apparently it blistered the hell out of me I was doing something outside and I started feeling like a stinging sensation and looked I thought I cut myself to start with and then I realized it was a blister and yes it hurts as tender as hell so I haven't tried to pop it yet I'll give it a day or two then it'll probably pop on its own had it for two days now but this is the heating pad from hell Woo! <laughs> anyway